Hillbilly DVD Reviews Unboxing Series today we got the UK edition of Sherlock Holmes A Game of Chateaus This one being your typical fucking UK garbage triple play Blu-ray plus DVD ultraviolet digital copy that doesn't work unless you have 3G or a Wi-Fi connection <laughs> I have not seen this movie yet I did see the first one I have the uh, actually a couple steelbooks of the first one they're really cool design steel books. Did not care for the movie too much. Um, this isn't just me making up bullshit, but Guy Ritchie said, you know, the only reason he wanted to do a Sherlock Holmes movie so he could turn uh, Sherlock and Watson gay and whatever. And, you know, it, it, it fucking shows, man. Because that's pretty much all you have in these movies. You have gay Sherlock Holmes and a gay Watson. But, I mean, not really, because, you know, this is Hollywood PG-13 bullshit. But it looks like he's taking it a step further in this one. And, you know, hey, I don't have a problem with the gay Sherlock Holmes, if it's a good movie or whatever. But, uh, I don't know, I just don't think you sh that should be your only reason for directing, like, a franchise of films or whatever. But, hey, that's Guy Ritchie, man. He fucking married Madonna, you know. He, he knows what he's doing, right? Yeah, whatever, Guy Ritchie. Anyway, here we got the front. The game of shadows has begun. Sherlock Holmes stands pensively in front of the fucking old... <laughs> English paints out, holding his gun, ready to strike on anything that comes his way. Anyway, that's the front, the side. Oh, this is a little, little tiny print of bullshit. You can't even, I bet you can't read that. I can fucking, I can barely read it. Little tiny shit, it's just Sherlock Holmes. Anyway, and then in the back, we got Watson, played by Julo. I, I actually, I don't know, I might take some shit for saying this, but I think Robert Downey Jr. is kind of a corny motherfucker nowadays. I thought he was great in the 80s. You know, I, I don't get much mileage out of him fucking rolling his eyes and wearing eyeliner and shit at Sherlock Holmes. But I, I, I do like Jude Law, man. I, he does a good fucking job, man. And what the fuck? He really is British. He should have been Sherlock Holmes, not fucking crackhead Danny Jr. Anyway, we got the inside. Oh, got to get my ultraviolet little bullshit out so you don't steal it. Because you know I'm going to use it. I can't let you have it. I got to need my ultraviolet. We got disc galore. This one being the Blu-ray disc. And you can tell us the UK edition because it's got fucking 12. Because, you know, badass movies are PG-13 here or 12. You know, they're that 12 year old see it. And then we have the DVD copy, which lazily has the same fucking picture on it. That is also rated 12. Got the inside here. It's like some newspaper bullshit. And a bunch of shit, I guess, all about Sherlock Holmes or whatever. All his cases and shit. But anyway, that was it. For Sherlock Holmes, Games of Shadows, old scallywags, get together and watch your fucking countryman hero be fucking decimated by Robert Downey Jr.'s fucking corny acting. Ha!